Congratulations to Rosalind Yellow's graduating class of 2020. I'm very proud of all of your accomplishments over the years and know that each and every one of you will be a success in middle school. While at Yellow, you excelled academically and participated in extracurricular activities that supported your whole child growth. I salute you and your families in your commitment to your education and know that you will look fondly upon Yellow when you think about the friends and memories you've made. I will leave you with four assignments. Number one, when you get to middle school, don't worry what others think, just be you. Number two, listen to your family. Number three, love yourself. And number four, keep going. Congratulations, class of 2020. You did it. Congratulations, class of 2020. It has been an incredible honor to be your teacher this year. And you have made yourself, your parents, and us very, very proud. You have worked incredibly hard, and we're very proud of you. You have faced many challenges this year, and you have demonstrated an immense, immense bravery, determination, and perseverance. These are the qualities that will get you through what's ahead in your next chapter. Parents, we would like to particularly thank you for having your children attend our school and trusting us with them every day. We especially want to thank you for raising the amazing group of young adults who stand before us today. We know that being involved in your child's life leads them to more opportunities for success in the future. This group that stands in front of us has shown many positive qualities. We know this all starts at home. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Awesome fifth grade awesome parents and students. Fifth grade parents and students. Congratulations, fifth grade. You made it. You're now middle schoolers. You guys have worked so hard over the past three years. I'm so proud of everything you've accomplished, and I've been lucky to be your teacher during this time. You guys have left a mark on my heart. I will never forget you. I want you guys to remember that you guys can do anything you want. Just put your mind into it and your heart and just work hard. The world is yours. Good luck in middle school and I love you guys. Good morning. I am honored to congratulate the class of 2020. Yala's founding first grade students from 2015, now ending fifth grade. Yala was founded with a mission to educate the whole child, developing strong moral character and excellent academic achievement for all students. A public school with the feel of private school education. Each of you has witnessed the hardships of bringing Yala's vision to fruition. From our opening day, September 1st, 2015, when new classroom furniture was still being assembled by staff, teachers, and volunteers, you have endured much, including Flooded classrooms when water pipes burst during the cold snap of February 2016. Water buckets in several classrooms collecting the rainwater from our various leaky roofs until we had the money to replace the roofs. The sudden snowstorm of November 16, 2018, which left some of you stranded on buses past midnight. And now, the COVID-19 pandemic where each of you has had a front row seat in the national experiment of distance learning. You are a part of history. All 47 of you were challenged by these hardships and came through so much stronger and wiser. You have grit. You have also had many joyous experiences at Yala, exploring every two weeks the American Museum of Natural History competing on Saturday and Sundays in chess and fencing tournaments, winning New York State Chess Championships in four divisions, three in 2018, one in 2019, singing before the Bronx Opera Chorus annual performance of Handel's Messiah in 2018, singing with the Bronx Arts Ensembles Jazz Band in Van Cortlandt Park at the 2019 Memorial Day Concert, competing with and defeating some of the best nationally ranked 
public and private school fencers at Hunter Elementary and the New York Fencers Club, sharing Thanksgiving dinners with Yala families at our annual Thanksgiving feast in the late morning. And finally, bonding with classmates and parents in Yala's weekly family support groups, where you develop many deeper friendships. My goal in starting the Rosalind Yala Charter School has been to expose our young students to worlds beyond the Bronx and prove that they can compete with the very best, building self-esteem and encouraging deeper family commitment. You have lived Yala's vision from the beginning, and I am so proud of you. You're on a path to succeed in middle school, high school, and college, and I look forward to hearing from you about your future successes. Now, I would like to give special thanks to your families for sticking with Yala. Without their support, Yala would not have been named in 2020 an Achievement Recognition School by New York State Education Commissioner Shannon Taha. Thank you and good luck. Juan Alvarez. Hawa Conte. Jennifer Diallo. Peyton Duger. Alan Fall. Carlini Furman. Angel Rodriguez Kaylin Green Tian Kirkland Jaden Lipkins Nisi Llanos Jadlyn Martinez Chase Mercado Mary Angelis Mercedes Natalie Nunez Amaya Pena JC Reyes Jordan Rivas Ronnie Rodriguez Abigail Romero Christopher Salvador Briani Sanchez
Camilla Soto. Genzel Tavares. Aime Van Tool. Sadie Acevedo. Siley Arias. Ivalice Bogarin. Nafisatu Danzo. Jaden Diaz. Kaden Diaz. Usman Galaco. Analia Gonzalez. Gabriela Guerrero. Sienna Hernandez. Aisha Hidara. Rugayatu Kuma. Nashla Martinez. Alfred Madrano. Exoye Mogel. Christopher Pena. Sophia Pena. Darlene Rodriguez. Rihanna Rodriguez. Inaya Sanchez. Isitu Tunkara. Miriam Wage. Hello, yellow fifth graders. Congratulations, you did it. You graduated. I am so very happy and proud of all of you. You have accomplished something that is incredible, especially during these tough times. However, I know that all of you are going to achieve the best things and you will accomplish so much more in your new schools. So I really hope that you guys always remember that Hard work does pay off and just have a lot of dedication and you will go very far with your talents. I wish you all the best. 
Take care. Hello, Rosalind Yalo, fifth grade graduates. I wanted to take a moment to say a few words on your graduation day. I've had the privilege of working with you for the past two years, and every day it has been a joy getting to know you and your families. We are so proud of everything that you have accomplished, and I'm sure the best is yet to come. Although we live in uncertain times, students in Brown and Stanford have shown this year and during their entire time at YALO that they are prepared to meet the future's challenges. I hope you look back on your experiences at YALO fondly and remember our school as a place where you developed lifelong skills, made lifelong friends, and gained a foundation to make all of your future educational dreams and aspirations possible. Finally, always remember to thank your parents and guardians. They made today possible, and we are proud to celebrate it with you. Congratulations, fifth grade graduates. I am so proud of all of you. You've all worked exceptionally hard to get where you are going. And to my Princeton crew that I had in first grade way, way long time ago, Howard, Peyton, Maria Angelis, Natalie, Gabriella, Aisha, Nashla, Jaden, Diaz, Darlene, Rihanna, and Nisi. I am so proud. You guys all came so far. And I just wish you all the best of luck. And I'm here. So if you need me for anything, I am here. When you get older, please keep in touch so you can tell me what you're doing. I would love to hear. I'm so proud of all of you. Best of luck. Go yellow. Dear class of 2020, congratulations on your graduation. It has been a strange year so far, but I am proud of you achieving your goals at Rosalind Yarrow Charter School. Today, we might not have flowers and your friends are not sitting next to you. What we do have is possibly the most special graduation ceremony in history. Five years ago, it was a beautiful sunny day. Our school opened in 2015. I remember clearly the day when we met at our school parking lot because we were so excited to start the new school. On that day, you were the grade one scholars who opened just one chapter and were ready to go to your new school lives. You continued to pile up your experience with your friends learned so many things, especially the Singapore math that was new to you. Someone says that you achieved so many things. I am proud of you, who are the first class of graduation at Rosalind Yarrow Charter School. We are very excited about what lays ahead of you, regardless of where or how far you will be in your new lives. I hope our ceremony today can give you some sort of comfort, hope, and maybe even a bit of inspiration. I wish you to continue to believe your potentials, challenge the things that you are interested in, and never give up to make your life happier with your family, friends, and the people who will meet with you in your future. Congratulations! Hi, fifth grade. I cannot believe that you are moving on to middle school. I am so proud of you. I have known so many of you since first grade, and I've known a bunch of you also since second grade. I can't believe that we started this school together and look at how far we've, become, we've come or you've come. I'm so, so proud of you. I hope that I still continue to see you next year, even though you're going to be big middle schoolers. But I want you to come back and visit. And I want you to have a wonderful summer. And I wish you so much success and joy and happiness in your new school. And just know that I am going to miss you very, very much. Love you, love you, love you. Good luck. Congratulations, class of 2020 at Rosalind Yellow Charter School. I'm really proud of you all, and I can't wait to see what happens when you guys arrive in middle school and you come back to visit us. I had a poem I wanted to read you guys that I remembered most of it since I was a kid, but um, I'm going to read it to you, and I think it's apropos for this time. 
How far you go in life depends on your being tender with the young, compassionate with the aged, sympathetic with the striving, and tolerant of the weak and strong, because someday in your life you will have been all of these. So do the best you can always. We're going to miss you here. We love you, and congratulations again. Take care.